Hi folks, this is just a thought for the day, but in my opinion, Eldis, I cannot really say his name, Albert, oh, sorry, I can't say his name, I'm terrible to say names, um, you know what I mean, would be the most ideal James Bond going. But unfortunately, because of woke, he never will be. And the reason I say that is, can you imagine, he's got, I mean, he's just your natural coolest guy. Um... And it'd just be, it'd just be entertaining. You can imagine him in in the cool suit, driving the Aston Martin, you know, bedding hot chicks. But in this modern world, rubbish world, they won't allow it. They won't allow him to have funny lines. It'd all be ugh, bland and ugh. I mean, yeah, they could make him Bond, but I mean, would he be the Bond, it, the brilliant Bond he could be? That's my point. And I don't think, you know, I think any writer would love to write because you you could imagine he could deliver all the brilliant lines. It reminds me of, um, oh, God, Lucy, one of my favourite Bonds, um, Roger Moore. It reminds me of Roger Moore, that you could just give him all the fun lines and you'd have all the gadgets and everything. But there's no way the woke would let it happen. You know, I doubt if he'd even be able to jump into bed with a woman. Because it'd be sexist and all this. And oh, it'd just be bland rubbish. And that's the trouble. He could be one of the best Bonds going. But they'll never allow it. And that's because of royal rubbish.